Alright guys, in this video I'm going to show you guys my Airsoft <clears throat> collection or armory. So I'm going to have that special guest that you saw earlier. His channel is Jim Bob. If you're looking for it, it's pretty hard to find. So if you want to find it, just search up PSP 1000 drop test and just search for the one where it's Jim Bob if you want to find it. So he's going to be filming. Start off with this bad boy right here. This is the FAMAS. It is spring. So, right now, see how I keep pulling the trigger? It's not electric, it's just spring. It sucks. Most of my guns are spring except one of them. Then I have, and the ITS magazine looks like this. So, this would be ITS magazine. It just attaches into the bottom or back. Like so, and then you just pop this back in. There you go. And also, this piece right here goes on just like this, but I don't know where the screw is for it. Unless it's multiple screws, then I know how to put it on. And a flashlight used to go here, but I don't have that flashlight anymore. <coughs> and then this A cob also came with it, but I put some camel here and camel on this barrel. And the so this is a shot my shotgun. I guess it had a bullet in there. <clears throat> so this one has a attachable or unattachable orange tip. See, no orange tip anymore. Got the camel barrel. And I usually put this here, but I don't have it on right now. So that goes there. And this piece, this tactical rail, you just put on right here. Now you got a tactical rail for scopes or late or whatever you want to put on there. And this is the mag for it. Put that in right here. And then we're going to move on to my worst pistol ever. I am going to show you guys why it is the worst pistol ever. So I'm going to put this BB in here. Put it in, pop it back, and in three, two, one. It didn't even hurt. See, there's me. You can put that there. It's called the Millennium PT-11 Hamas shotgun. And then this is my Stinger P-30T. This is my favorite weapon of choice here. The reason it is my favorite is because it is the only one my friends let me shoot them with. That is actually good. Decent pistol. So... And it's got this little lever thing, but it's spring, 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 spring. And then I come to this bad boy. Here's his mag. And then here is the gun. This one I have done a review for. The M&P 40 Smith & Wesson. The review for it will be either up shortly. Or it is up. CO2 powered. My only non-spring gun. So, this is my favorite, but my friends are afraid to get shot with this one, so this is more of a target practice and to say I have a CO2. And then for eye protection or protection, I have this pair of sweet red goggles, but they fog up in about two seconds. And I have these nice pair of shades that I wear. And I got a holster that I put on my belt sometimes. Every once in a while I'll put this, I'll use this one. So that's pretty much, and then I have Crosman, I recommend Crosman for the CO2. So that's pretty much my Airsoft Armory. So, thanks for tuning in and watching this. I will leave with a shot from my Tomas. So put this in. If I put it in the right way. Now let's do this. There's your shot.